Hey, Jeff Sauer here, and I just wanted to encourage you to listen to our next podcast episode. This is episode 85 of the Jumpstart Podcast, and it's one of those jeff episodes where I just talk about a topic that's near and dear to my heart. Now, this episode is going to be going live while I am in Hungary. I'm going to be in Hungary for the Super Week Conference, basically networking with a bunch of analytics professionals, a bunch of people that I really hold near and dear to my heart. And so for this episode, what I really talk about is the value of networking and expanding your personal network and how sometimes you need to go where people are in order to grow and to form the connections that you want to form. Now, Super Week is something that's near and dear to my heart because it's the first time that I ever did a speaking gig internationally. And not only that, but it's one of the first times that I met a lot of the people that I consider to be friends in the analytics industry, people that I really respect, people that I've come to know over the years and become pretty solid friends with. It all started with this weekend in 2014 on a mountaintop in Hungary at the Super Week Conference. So that's why I'm going back this year in 2018. The first time that I went there was 2014. Uh, 2014, it was about two months after I had left my gig, at my full-time gig at my agency, and I was sort of figuring out what I was going to do with my life. I spent a lot of time in 2014 doing the wrong things, and so it's going to be nice to go back to Super Week and go back to Hungary and meet some of the people that I met during that first time. So yes, I did a lot of wrong things in 2014, but I'm better off because of it. And because of those choices I made, that's why we're here today. But what I really wanted to talk about was on that mountain, some of the people that I met. So I met people like Peter O'Neill, who is a really successful analyst who I had met for the first time there. He's out of the UK. I met Simo Ahava, who has been on the podcast before, a really good friend of mine. We met at Super Week that same time. Met Doug Hall, the fast bloke, really cool guy that I met at the Super Week conference. Yehoshua Corin, who's the analytics ninja, we met there, formed a relationship. Um, I actually had met for probably the 10th time in person Avinash Kashik at that first Super Week conference, and, and that was really cool. I rode up to the mountain in Hungary with Caleb Whitmore and Sam from Analytics Pros, and we've struck up a relationship ever since with the Analytics Pros group. Now I'm, it's going to sound like I'm being shallow because I'm forgetting some people, but I've met so many people at this conference, and really it's one of the coolest things that I've done. Basically to be in a on a mountaintop in Hungary at this cool hotel with people who just talk about analytics. There's really nowhere to go but to the sessions. There's really a lot of fun to be had, um, meet people. People like Julian Coquet, who is a really cool guy, good friend of mine, we all met on this mountaintop. And so it's been really awesome. I'm looking forward to doing it again, and actually I'm doing it right now at the time that you watch this video. Now the importance of networking is something that I go in depth in on episode number 85, talk about the value that it brings, the value of relationships, how it's turned into new business opportunities, and all the cool things that have happened as a result of putting myself out there and jumping on that plane for the first time and going to Hungary for the Super Week conference. A lot has changed in my life since that point in time, and so I look at it almost as a jumping off point. Since this time, four years ago in 2014, I moved to San Francisco from Minneapolis, and then I decided that I didn't like San Francisco, so I've been a digital nomad ever since. I started the PPC course website, I started the analytics course website, and of course the agency course website. I've done a lot. I've grown Jeffalytics from a traffic perspective. I've grown the team out. So many things have happened since that point in time. So this is going to be a cool episode because you're going to see both the immediate value of going to conferences and putting yourself out there, as well as the long-term value that it's positioned with me and the value that I've gotten out of going to this conference. And finally, I wanted to thank Zoli, the organizer of the Super Week conference. He's a really cool guy, and we've gotten to know each other well over the years. I've done a Super Week with him in India in Jamaica and in Hungary. This is my third time in Hungary and it's been really cool. And so if you want to get to know all these people that I talk about, we'll have links to them and their Twitter accounts in our notes on the YouTube channel. And also send Zoli a tweet and just say, hey, Jeff thinks that you're awesome. That'd be really cool if you could do this. One of the things that you learn in this business is that the organizers of these events are sometimes and almost always the unsung heroes. Just because you're on stage doesn't mean that there's other people who aren't putting a lot of efforts into making these things work. Being on stage is actually probably the easiest part of being at a conference. And so Zoli, thank you so much for the opportunity and the continued opportunities to work with you. And hopefully we're all enjoying some kind of libation at the bonfire right now on top of the mountain in Hungary. 
And so that's it for this episode. Make sure you listen to the podcast episode when it goes to live tomorrow. If you want to see the beginning of my international speaking career and what it's meant for me ever since, it's going to be a reflective episode and just talking about how all this stuff comes together. All right. Thanks so much. Thank you.